The track was revived after the war. The first event, the Grand Prix de Reims in July 1947, was won by Christian Kautz in a Maserati. Alberto Ascari made his Grand Prix debut. In 1948, Jean-Pierre Vermeil won the French Grand Prix in the Alpha 158. Tazio Nuvolari took over Villarese's Maserati for a few laps in his last ever Grand Prix. In 1949, Louis Rosier and Louis Chiron in Lago Talbos had a fierce battle with Prince Bira's Maserati 4 CLT and Peter Whitehead's 125 Ferrari. Chiron won, repeating his pre-war French Grand Prix success. When the Formula One World Championship started in 1950, Reims was the host of the French Grand Prix and Juan Manuel Fangio was the winner in the Alpha 158. By 1951, Fangio was at the top of his form, but the Alphas were under pressure from the Ferraris. At the first pit stops, Fangio took over the car from Fagioli. The veteran Fagioli was so upset that he retired from Grand Prix racing on the spot despite co-driving the winning car. 